Hello and welcome along to our unboxing video here of the JVC DLA X7000B. This has just arrived at one of the AV Forums review rooms for review, so let's have a look and see what's inside the box. So let's start by opening up the box and seeing what's inside. So unlike previous JVC projector boxes, normally we'd have a, a cardboard box here which you would take out and it'd have all the accessories like the power sockets and so on inside. Uh, they've obviously changed the design for this year, so what we have here are some manuals, quick start guide, European guarantee and so on. Next we have the power cables, so European power cable there. And of course we have the UK power cable with the kettle socket on there. So up in the top corner of the box, we have this year's JVC remote control for the X7000. And I don't want to get out of focus, but there are some changes. I have the one from the X700 here. And just quickly looking, the, the buttons have changed. Now we have more lens memory functionality so you have two memory buttons there for the lens memory as well as the lens control and cmd and so on there is a light button and then down the bottom just checking again with the old one uh, there are changes there so picture mode uh, we lose two of them from there so um so it's stage and photo uh, that are missing from the new remote control there is an mpc button and some other direct picture quality buttons at the bottom there as well and also in the box at the back there are some batteries so we'll get the projector out and we'll have a closer look so now we've got the x7000 out of the box now this is a retail production unit this is not a pre-production unit um, this is absolutely brand new as you could tell from the box when we opened it um, it hasn't been used before and it looks identical to probably the last five generations have used the same chassis on this projector and I guess if it ain't broke, then no need to fix it. And as you can see here, because this is the 7000 and it's a little bit higher than the X5000 that Steve looked at earlier this month, you can see that it has the automatic lens cover, which covers up the lens when the unit is switched off. But otherwise, it looks identical to the last five generations of projector. So let's have a quick look around the back. So moving around to the back of the X7000 here, we can see that we've got two HDMI inputs there. Both of those are HDMI 2.08. They will accept HDR metadata. They're also HD CP 2.2 compatible. So they are uh, completely up to date for the latest 4K signals. And also here we have a, an ethernet port. There's also an RS-232 control port, the 3D synchro port for uh, the little transmitter, which sticks in the back there and a 12 volt trigger. And to the right hand side, we have the controls if you lose the remote control. And that's our look at the X7000 out of the box. We'll get it set up and the review should be around very soon. Don't forget you can read our full reviews at avforums.com forward slash reviews. You can watch more videos at avforums.com forward slash videos. And why not follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. Thanks for watching.